Hey, this is Randy Velker with Technophobics Anonymous. Uh, today we're going to be looking at uh, what is the internet? What is a web page? Finally, we're getting to some of the bread and butter of um, the program here. Um, a web page is simply a document that's on someone's computer. Right? Now, this computer is connected to a whole uh, connection of other computers, right? including yours, as soon as you hook it up and connect it to the internet. So you can go to their computer, you can look at the document that they have put up there. Now, um, they call it a web page, it could be a document that includes photos, could include videos, could include sound, could include things for you to buy, uh, all kinds of things, but it's set up and hosted and running off of somebody else's computer. And you will be going um, through what is known as the internet uh, and go and take a look at uh, that person's computer. Uh, and that's what the compu that's what the internet is. Uh, it's just a connection of thousands and millions of different computers. Uh, and you have a certain amount of access that you can go in and take a look at certain pages um, on those different um, computers. Uh, now, what we need in order to connect to the internet is we need a computer. Uh, we've already been talking about that, and we've kind of uh, set up and configured the computer, so you're starting to get a little bit comfortable with that. Uh, the second thing you need is on the back of your computer you need a modem. A modem is uh, hardware, it's an actual piece uh, piece of hardware that you're going to have to buy um, and it may already be on the back of your computer. And what it does is it allows your computer to talk with other computers. Um, <clears throat> you're going to have to have a modem, that's, that's a necessity for you to hook up to the internet. Uh, the good thing is most computers nowadays come with some type of a network card or modem already hooked up on them. Um, now, uh, beyond needing a modem, the other thing you're going to need is you're going to need what is called an internet service provider. All right? Now, this is a company that gives you an on-ramp to the computer. It will take your computer and it will uh, give you access to all of the other computers. Now, these internet service providers um, work in a couple different ways. They can uh, have a telephone number that you call into and then you'll have access over your phone line. Um, you would need a phone modem then if you were going to have access uh, in that way. Or many of them uh, are uh, work as a cable company. Right? So as your ca uh, cable uh, movies are coming in, they'll also allow you to have internet access. And in that case, you'll have a uh, cable modem and they will provide that cable modem for you. Um, <clears throat> now there are also uh, there's new ways of connecting to the internet um, happening rapidly all the time. Broadband um, and uh, satellite connections, uh, these di different types, and you'll need a special modem any way that you hook up uh, with through your internet service provider. Uh, for many years, the only uh, internet service providers that were available was uh, were through phone companies. So you had to dial, and they were called dial-up. Um, now, dial-up modems are much faster than they ever were, uh, but they are unbearably slow. Um, if you are considering hooking up to the internet and planning on using a, a, a phone uh, connection uh, with a phone modem, just stop it. Uh, don't. Uh, that's that's poor thinking. Uh, you need to have some kind of a broadband connection, if at all possible. Then you'll be able to see videos, you'll be able to uh, watch movies, you'll be able to use your computer uh, to watch uh, videos and movies online. Um, and, and this is, you're only going to need more connection speed in the future, and the connection speeds are coming, the prices are coming down, down, down. So if you're uh, wondering what kind of internet service provider um, that you need to get, you certainly ought to be uh, trying for uh, some type of a, a cable, uh, cable modem or some type of a broadband connection. Um, Alright, next we're going to be looking at the different browsers, which would be the software programs that you need in order to connect to the internet. Um, so, uh, this is Randy Velker. Uh, thanks for watching.